What up, what up, GSD, PJP in the house. Right now I got the beep, 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 latest, latest, beep, 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 latest news flash for you. Right now in China, they are making a real big push for their citizens and their kids to learn English. I put a link in the um, description box. Please check it out. I read a little bit about it, and they are trying to get their kids to be fluent in English by the time they are 10 years old. So, do you know what that means? All that means there's a lot. They are going to be investing millions, if not billions, of dollars into this. If you read the article, which I didn't read all of it, and there are schools popping up all over China, private schools. And whether these schools are Chinese owned or foreign owned, I do not know. But I do know you guys might want to try to uh, get in on it and learn Chinese because people out there do not hate you and if you speak the language that breaks down many 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 barriers then at least you know if they got something smart to say then you know you can uh, understand what they're saying and put some sense in their head okay um, they go to police so I gotta put my hand down so he doesn't see my phone but anyway, so you might want to check into that because there are going to be lots and lots and lots of jobs. All the kids that are over there, trust me, these private schools will not be able to handle them. Another thing, too, don't worry about any racism. There are a lot of brothers, probably a lot of brothers or Africans and people over there, you know, that can give you a hand. Contact them. Go to www.sharedtalk.com. That is a online um, English learning community where you can learn Chinese one-on-one -on -one with Chinese people. And it is free. Then, if you don't want to do that or you don't have the means to do that, then you can go to, I think his name is Lashao55000, I believe that's his name. If I'll put this, um, actually, it'll be in the descriptions, or you, you should, if you didn't read the descriptions, descriptions, it'll be in there. And he is very good at teaching lots and lots and lots and lots and lots and lots of languages, and you can learn from him also. Another thing is that business overseas is starting to. I wouldn't say boom, but you know, in the Chinese sector anyway, you know, um, there's money to be made everywhere. You brothers, you sisters, if you got degrees and you're single, please travel. Don't sit in the United States waiting for people to pay you and give you a job. You know, you can go overseas if you're single and you um, want to get married and you can't find a brother or, or a sister who you want to marry then you can always, you know, go overseas and, you know, I'm not advocating anything bad or anything, but I'm just saying, you know, that a lot of um, mixed marriages, some of them do fail, but the smart ones, you know, they're supportive. So if you get your wife who, she, she might even have a degree, you know, and she might want to do a job and she just needs someone to support her, but maybe, you know, her the people heard them heard me and probably can and you come along and support her and help her out or she supports you and you're an American so there are, are a lots there are lots and lots and lots of uh how can I say that there are lots and lots of opportunities for people of how can I say that for people of uh different cultures to help each other you guys get married you don't get married fine whatever if you do then, you know, there's going to be other, that's just a whole different story, you know, but still, you know, it's all about cultural understanding and things like that. I think the reason that, well, anyway, I want to get off the subject, but like I said, you know, go overseas and do investing and stuff, you know, you look in your clothes, see what other clothes are made, you know, and if they're made in those countries, then people are investing a lot of money in those countries to do a lot of things, so I suggest that you go over there and get some of that money too and wow wow it's busy
Anyway, I suggest you go over there and, and get some of that money because it's available. But like I said, China, you know, their um, schools are popping up and I'm sure you don't need to learn Japanese Chinese to teach English if you're smart. And, uh, but it's not a bad thing to learn it because, uh, let's say hi to these guys. Hello. Kijua, kijua, kijua. Hello. And uh, it's not a bad language to learn. And the more you learn, you know, the better things all can be, or the better things will be for you. But anyway, go over there and check it out. You know, go online, see what you can find. I'll share everything online. It might be in Chinese, whatever. But, you know, there's a lot of um, people over there. And you can meet some Chinese people over there that do speak English, especially on sharetalk.com. And, you know, talk to them and see what they say, you know. Because I um, met a couple of girls on there, and you know they taught me, and it was it was real cool. You know, they spoke English too, and they were real nice. I tell them I was black, and it's like, well, you know, it's was, it was all cool, you know. So anyway, check it out. Peace.